We did say on this show that when he was available, there were teams looking at him, and Boston was obviously one of them because uh, Dombrowski had worked with John Henry before. Like, they're, they're boys. So I'm not surprised at all that he ended up the Red Sox. Uh, I, you know, I thought he'd uh, get a job there more than anywhere else. When you, you know, it's who you know. It's, that's his boy, Henry, so why wouldn't they hire him? He's good at what he does. I, in fact, I'm surprised that they fired him in, in Detroit, frankly, because they knew they were going to clean house, and they knew they obviously knew they couldn't sign Price, even though I thought that they could have. They had the money. Don't tell me Illich doesn't have the money to pay uh, David Price. They just didn't want to pay him. And then they got rid of Cespedes, and at that point you knew that they were blowing it all up. So, But I was surprised they fired him. They told him, blow it up. Or he said, we're blowing it up. But at the end of the day, they got a lot for those guys. And uh, down the road, they'll be back together again, winning. Uh, I, look, people have been ripping on Verlander. He's actually pitched well the last couple outings. Not like he used to, but he's getting his groove back a little bit, you have to admit. And um, I'm not really that surprised he ended up in Boston. I was more surprised they got rid of him in Detroit, to be honest with you.